emphasizing more on women com- community which are highly neglected exactly right yes ma'am so uh, like i am not getting what uh, are you delivering like educating them uh, like mentoring them how you will be delivering or imparting your knowledge to the uh, people or to the women out there okay uh that's a good question uh sunil thank you very much uh the first important thing is this project because uh it's a part of the international glamour project miss india okay and the time limit is uh as i have mentioned it was like 90 days but we got an extension of one more month so we have this uh, deadline as 15th may so whatever fund we we would be uh, collecting so this uh it would be utilized for uh the women so what happens is we are we want to make them financially independent now why financially independent uh, i would like to give you an example so in our uh, small town like uh, i we had a cook in our house because i as i've mentioned that we i come from a very small town of maharashtra <clears throat> so we had a cook her husband passed away uh he he was in mumbai she could not even get her his, uh, her husband's uh, body to the native because of the challenges of uh, financial challenges and she immediately had to take charge of the family now there was no resource she did not have knowledge she did not have uh, anything uh, to start uh, to support her family and that is the biggest challenge uh, that i have seen in the rural parts of india so if anything and there's nothing called as remarriage in if you know about it there's nothing called as remarriage for a woman in rural parts of india so if they are if anything happens to the husband they are all alone and they have to take a charge of the entire family so uh, there are huge there are different kind of challenges a woman face for example uh, there are husband who are working but they do not give money to their wife at all because they are addicted they have different kinds of uh, addictions uh, they they are uh, and and it is the survival it is uh, very uh, it's very uh, primary for a woman because she struggles to do uh, to support the family her kids she has to see her kids uh, without food for so many days so there are different kind of challenges this woman uh, rural woman uh, undergoes and that's the reason uh, it is a very strong uh, you know after looking at so many challenges uh, and i have picked up this cause and it is very close to my heart because i have personally seen these challenges so we want to make them financially independent now financial independence doesn't just come that okay for example i'm giving them sewing machine for example i'm just giving but if they do not have knowledge what would they do so we do not just want to give them the sewing machine we want to give them the knowledge we want to and uh, not only the knowledge if they have knowledge if they have the uh, ability they have passion to do but if the products are not uh, purchased what would they do you know it's waste so we want you to have that entire system from providing knowledge to uh, getting them uh, work start working and also someone to buy their products so it's, it's a, a system ecosystem exactly it's an it's ecosystem that we would like of, uh, women empowerment exactly so that is what we are focusing so that uh, we can help them at least whatever we can and that's the reason the fund is very important at the moment as much as fund we raise uh, that much of uh, uh, we can uh, contribute towards these women yeah please go ahead sonu ma'am actually uh, like uh, you are doing a very good job okay thank you uh, uh, if i consider the patriarchal society like uh, i know that there is a revolution after the independence women are in like families encouraging them to work to go out but uh, still 70% of the uh, indian population lives in rural areas where the mentality is still backward like they are still not uh, that that much educated they want they are not believing in upliftment of the women so how you will be dealing with these challenges with these hardships how you will be uh, like dragging the women out from the family to go out and work so that she can uh, uh, like uh, pay and helping hand to the family like she can take the bread uh that's a good good question sonal thank you for asking a uh, very important and uh, it's very important to understand that it is not that simple to change the mentality uh 
you know suddenly because yes, there's a lot of uh, tradition if you see different parts of india they have different kinds of uh, superstitions and so many things like uh, they it it goes generations to generations right and one important thing if you understand why i have chosen this woman because if you see that if women has that the if you change the thought process of a woman the thought process of the entire family changes yes. you would believe that because yes, the ma. the children because she would pass on the same knowledge thoughts and you know to her kids and it it happens so it is very important that we uplift this woman and uh, what that's the that is the first step we are doing it um i i do not know how much success uh, rate we would get uh, you know because it's a, a large number of population but uh, you know mm -hmm. it's very important that we do our bit we we are we do our bit we contribute we do not afraid okay it's a very big population i cannot change alone why do we think that so because if you walk alone it if you believe in your cause trust me there are people who would come and support you and you would have a huge force together and together we can bring and a huge change in uh, the thought process and help these women and if the thought process of this woman is change and their thought process in the family would change and so the thought process we would not uh, have this we, we cannot have this woman uh, and this thought process in into the loop generations after generations so very important that we get them out of this loop so uh, that is the first step and uh, i'm sure when we help them uh, to uh, and 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 the ma more major factor is that if we uh, give them some of uh, uh, small things like you know if you have uh, 10 women coming together it is very easy for them to collaborate okay they would see that you know okay there are women who are coming together and they are performing so they would have that passion okay let me also do because you know and the word of mouth is very powerful in the rural areas because what it's a small town and if you encourage those 10 uh, women they would have that 10 women connected to different their neighbors and people would gather so that power is very very important and we have to find out those women and then encourage them and then get the entire village so definitely uh, it's a long uh, way for us to go but definitely not uh, we cannot give up and we have to work with equal passion and uh, we have to help them come out of this loop hope that helps thank you ma'am yes ma'am thank you welcome anyone else has any